20 strange animals you didn't know exist. Number 20. Lowland Streak Tenric. This sunflower-looking creature lives along the eastern coastline with a long snout and scattered detachable quills. Number 19. Patagonian Mara. This strange large animal is somewhat similar to a rodent and often found in semi-open habitats in Argentina. With its long ears, it tends to somewhat resemble a jackrabbit, but seems to have the hooves to a deer. It's pretty short and compact and almost hairless. Others seem to think it's a rabbit-kangaroo hybrid, but that clearly doesn't seem possible. It's considered to be a near-threatened species and have been affected greatly by overhunting. Number 18. Sunda Colago. Also known as the flying lemur, even though it's not technically a lemur or fly, it does have the stretchy skin in its armpits that allows it to glide from tree to tree. It's native throughout Southeast Asia in countries like Laos, Vietnam, Thailand, Cambodia, and island nations in this region. It's capable of gliding a max distance of 100 meters or about 300 feet. That's pretty far for something that doesn't have wings. Number 7. Man Wolf The Man Wolf has extraordinary long legs for a type of canid but this is an adaptation. It's actually not a wolf or a fox, but it resembles one of these animals if they're wearing a pair of stilts. This is the largest species of canid found in South America, living mostly in Brazil, but also in parts of Bolivia, Paraguay, and Argentina. The man wolves are unique from other canids and don't live in packs. They tend to hunt small animals like rabbits, birds, fish, but mostly rodents. Number 16, the Yeti Crab. What's even more strange about this is that its legs are covered in its own food source, which is bacteria. The first Yeti crab was discovered off the Antarctica coast, near underwater volcanoes. This crustacean is not something you're going to find on a menu at Red Lobster. Since crabs are excellent in adapting to their environment, the hair that grows on their chest actually attracts microorganisms that they feast on. Number 15. The Garanook Also known as the Giraffe Gazelle, this long-necked antelope is only found in Africa. It's noticeable for its long giraffe-like neck and weighs about 62 kilometers or 115 pounds. This herbivore mainly eats foliage from trees, herbs, and flowers. It mainly prefers a species of plant known as acacias. Its long neck allows it to spot predators over the tall grass of their habitat. Number 14. The Cassowary The Cassowary is native to tropical forests in Papua New Guinea. It's the tallest species of bird, measuring about five and a half feet tall on average. They're also the second heaviest bird, weighing 129 pounds. Some female cassowaries have been reportedly measured in at six foot six inches tall, making it about the same size as Kobe Bryant. Number 13, Pink Fairy Armadillo. Probably not the most masculine name in the animal kingdom, the male fairy armadillo has the ability to curl up in a ball, kind of like Sonic the Hedgehog. This allows him to move around underground with fast speeds. These nocturnal insectivores live in central Argentina, and they mainly eat worms, snails, and small insects that are found underground. These tiny little guys are only 3.5 to 4.5 inches long and weigh 4.2 ounces. Number 12, the lamprey. This jawless fish is classified as a cyclostomata, which includes other jawless round-mouthed fish like hagfish. Looking directly down the mouth of a lamprey might send chills down your spine. They resemble eels in a way, but they don't have any scales. They use their sharp teeth to clamp onto other animals and cut into their bodies to suck their bodily fluids. They generally won't attack humans unless they're typically starved, so don't worry too much. Number 11, Walking Fish. Its more official name is Oxalotl, and it's not a species of fish, but a small species of salamander found around lakes in Mexico City. If this creature loses a limb, it won't need a prosthetic leg because it can regenerate them. It's listed currently as critically endangered and sold at Mexican food markets. They were once widespread across Mexico and a staple of Aztec cuisine. They grow about six to 18 inches and are also kept as exotic pets. Would you want one of these at your home? Number 10, Southern Right Whale Dolphin. This slender oceanic mammal is found only in the southern hemisphere in the waters near Antarctica and off the coast of Chile. They're actually the only species of dolphin without a dorsal fin. Adult southern right whales can measure anywhere from 5 foot 11 inches to 9 and a half feet long. They feast on squid, fish, and other octopus. Number 9. Gaharial 
This isn't your average crocodile. It's often found swimming in the waterways in India, and its jaw doesn't look quite intimidating as some crocs you might find in Australia. Its mouth or nose has 110 teeth and has adapted well to catching varieties of fish. This is also an extremely rare species that was once widespread across Indian rivers. With only 1,300 left in the wild and another 1,000 being held in captivity, these were almost extinct at one point. Number 8. Glowing Sea Turtle while exploring for a biofluorescent coral, scuba divers off the coast of the Solomon Islands were shocked when they discovered a glowing sea turtle. This is the first documented case of a glowing reptile in the wild. Most species that have the capability to glow like this are mostly invertebrates. Biofluorescence wasn't something scientists paid attention to until recently. What other natural glowing creatures could be out there? Number 7. Tarsier The tarsier is a cuddly looking primate that you probably didn't know existed and were once widespread in Southeast Asia. Fossils indicate that they haven't changed much in size in the past 45 million years. These guys are known to prey upon birds, snakes, lizards, and even bats. This is actually the only carnivorous primate. Each one of its eyes is actually heavier than its brain and it cannot rotate its eyeballs. It must turn its head if it wants to look in a different direction. Number 6. Saiga Antelope This strange species of antelope that looks like elf is found in a few countries near and in Russia such as Uzbekistan, Kazakhstan, and it's recognizable for its long, flexible nose. The saigas were relatively widespread across these regions until a mysterious illness reportedly wiped out 143,000 of them in two weeks. It still remains a mystery exactly what happened. This was about half the population of saigas at the time. Their numbers continue to dwindle, and it's believed that there's only 10 to 15,000 left. Number 5. Blanket Octopus Also known as the Trem Octopus, the males are extremely small in comparison to the females. Would you rather mate and die, or live the rest of your life a virgin? The male Blanket Octopus has to ask himself this question, since it dies shortly after reproducing. Its reproductive organ detaches, causing the female to fertilize her eggs. Once pregnant, the female can carry up to 100,000 eggs at a time, creating more of these creepy blanket octopi. Number 4. Longhorned Orb Weaver Spider You might not want to be sitting alone in the dark for this next one. This longhorned orb weaver spider has a total of 8 eyes and 8 legs. He also has devil-like horns sticking out of his abdomen. These are most commonly found in forests and fields of Asia. Once the spider finds its prey, it stuns it with a venomous bite, then wraps it in silk. The orb weaver web can also get quite intricate like you see in this photo. Number 3. Red-Lipped Batfish You'll find some very bizarre creatures on the Galapagos Islands, and one of the weirdest is the red-lipped batfish. Not only does it look like it's wearing a bright shade of lipstick, the batfish doesn't really swim. It sort of hobbles around on its fins that are modified to look like feet. It also has a lure on its head, which doesn't really seem to have a purpose. Number 2. The Panda Ant there is nothing too cuddly looking about this panda ant. This bizarre species was recently discovered. In fact, they aren't even an ant, but actually a wasp. The females are commonly wingless and have the black and white looking fur on their bodies. The intriguing looking ant is capable of knocking out an ant with its sting. Number 1. Glass Frog No, you're not looking at an x-ray. This glass frog was photographed in the Monte Verde cloud forest in Costa Rica with transparent skin. Why take the time to dissect a frog when all you have to do is look at it to see how its organs are functioning? These amphibians are pretty tiny as you can see in proportion to this person's finger.